Hello, I'm Mark Shavar, store manager at Mo's Outdoor Equipment Supply and Ace Hardware. And today we're going to talk about uneven ground and out in your lawn and soil compaction. There's a lot of yards that, you know, well, during the, the winter and that, you know, or for that matter, during the spring with a lot of rain and that, start to develop you know, uneven areas in the yard. You start to get areas where water pools and that, and customers that come in the store are looking for ways to fill in those gaps. The best way to do it is to come in. We recommend selling our Ace Topsoil or Scott's carries a couple different brands of soil that can be used in the yard to fill in those spots. Once you've just figured out where you've got all the different uneven spots in your yard, then you'll have to figure out how much dirt to buy. That's when you stop in my store here and we can recommend how many bags of the topsoil that we carry here to use in your yard. Uh, we sell a 40-pound bag of Ace Topsoil. We also have the miracle Grow brand of Topsoil and Pine Soils that can be used to fill in these spots in the yard. Once you go home then, you go ahead and rake into the areas that you're trying to even out. You're going to want to head and water it a little bit, and in some instances you're going to have to add grass seed to get grass going back in those spots where the yard is level, because in some instances grass is not going to grow back through the dirt that you're trying to even out. Another problem you're gonna encounter is soil compaction. Now, soil compaction is where the ground gets really, really hard and it's, it's very difficult for grass to grow in those instances. And the best way to take care of that would be to use a yard aerator. Now, we use one here at the store, we rent them, and the thing we're kind of cool about an aerator, what it's gonna do is, is you run it over your yard it's going to pull dirt plugs out where the ground was impacted and then it's going to allow moisture to go down into the soil if you water it or if it should rain in that and what it does it helps the you know, yard start to loosen up and it's going to grass is going to be able to grow a lot easier when's the best time to do soil compaction with an aerator i generally recommend doing it early spring or doing it in the fall the best time to do it because at this point then the ground is going to be softer it's not you know been heated like after summertime where the ground's really 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 hard or you know coming out of the winter where the grass is dormant and that that's when you want to do it when it's moist it makes it a lot easier to pull the the, the plugs out and then of course with the springtime with mother nature with the rain and that or if you're watering the yard the plugs will have a chance to break back down and go back into the yard but what it's going to do it's going to loosen up the soil so your grass is going to grow a lot better anyway again my name is mark shavar store manager at Mo's outdoor equipment supply and ace hardware if you have any other questions stop by the store and ask for me or any of my employees here go to buyatmoes.com our website or check out our facebook page thanks